So two days ago, I brought you guys pictures of the inside of the St. Francis Veterans Center. And although I know we had a lot of doubters within that video, I told you guys that I would bring you the legit method to get into this as soon as I was able to figure it out. And as soon as I was 100% sure that this was the working method. Now, I know a couple of different people have found different methods to get in there. Unfortunately, none of these methods actually helped me get into the room on the third floor, which is exactly what I was trying to do. But really quickly, I want to give a shout out to when boredom sets in because I know that he did have the very first method on YouTube. But in today's video i'll be showing you guys another method that lets you pretty much walk around freely anywhere within this area and that includes being able to bring in vehicles and fly in as well so like always let's waste no more time and let's get right into the video so over the last few days i've had a lot of people tell me in my comments that there was a method to get in by drowning yourself in the lake that you are spawned in every single time that you're knocked out now for the last few days i've been trying this method over and over again and i wasn't able to figure it out and it just plain out and simple wasn't working for me Every single time that I would try to drown myself, it would literally drown myself and it would kill me. Now, in the mix of all of this, one of the times that I was spawned in, I decided to jump into the water and swim towards the mansion until the only you song started to play. Now, the moment that the song started to play, I stayed underwater and I just stopped moving completely and I waited it out until my character basically drowned. Now, once you do this, your screen is going to flash completely white and you're going to hear a very interesting sound, which I will play for you guys in the background. <laughs> And your character all by himself will stand up out of the water and at this moment you'll be able to freely walk right through the gates and you can basically go anywhere you can even walk away from the saint francis veteran center go to the nearest place that has a helicopter grab the helicopter and fly all the way back and land right on the roof and nothing at all will ever happen to you it kind of seems like if the brainwash was taken off now of course i did try this method over and over again and it worked every single time one thing that i have not tried as of the recording of this video but i probably will keep you guys updated in the comments is trying to save after this point to see if maybe you did get rid of the brainwash and you can just freely walk in there whenever you want but anyways that is exactly how you get into the saint francis veteran center and man it's crazy that it was literally as simple as that but like i said in the start of the video huge shout out to uh when boredom sets in because he did come up with the very first method to get in on the ground level and also a huge shout out to every single person in my last video's comments that kept telling me about this link method you guys are absolutely brilliant but anyways guys if you guys enjoyed the video make sure to drop a like on it and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for all types of wildlands ghost war and far cry 5 content trying to figure this out was absolutely amazing and honestly i'm pretty confident this is not the last hunt that we're going to be having on far cry 5 one last thing before i go i want to apologize for the loud noise that you guys might be hearing in the background there was a bit of a blackout here the other day and they're changing a transformer in my backyard and for some reason they're throwing in cement i don't know it's a apparently a transformer that's underground but anyways if you guys are hearing that loud cement truck i want to apologize but anyways like always i will see you guys in the next video